hello and welcome to another video, another episode of For the Culture Kitchen. On the, this is not the on the road edition, actually. Also, this is your show, so. So I'm gonna go since you, this is your I'm show. Just saying, you feel like you need I'm to just saying. I'm just saying. Taking stuff off. You was yeah, not. Yeah, because you was giving me weird sentence. eye contact. It just felt like there was some tension. I was in trying the room. to support you. So I think me. you need to stop. Why you look like you? Oh, okay. And at the reunion, when Andy Cohen asked you about how you just acted, just to Shut replay up. this moment. Oh, okay, yes, Andrew. Is. Just kidding, guys. We love each other. We love each other. Anyways, um, hello everyone, and welcome <laughs> to another episode. For the Culture Kitchen. Here on For the Culture Kitchen, we make African, Caribbean, and Latin dishes for the culture. And on today's episode of For the Culture Kitchen, it's not on the road edition, but we have a special guest, okay? My younger sibling, we are related, so they tell me. Unfortunately. Uh. Wow, damn, you said that with a lot of passion. <laughs> you said that with a lot of passion. Psych, psych, I told a lot you of I love. This is my built-in, built-in bestie. Day, since day one, okay? She was there. She saw me the day I got home from the hospital. She looked after me all these years. No, she didn't. like, there, there you go, ruining the moment. <laughs> okay. There you go, killing the okay. vibe. <laughs> Today on For the Culture Kitchen, we are making Haitian. Grio. Yes, my friends, Haitian Grio, mm. which is fried pork. Oof. Now, <laughs> this the this the thing, this the thing about pork grio. You know what I'm saying? Let me tell you, let me educate y'all real quick. You it's a multi-day process. It's a multi-day process. You feel me? Like you can't just be cleaning the pork, marinating the pork, cooking the pork, frying the pork all yeah. in one day. Yeah. What you think this is? What you think this is? What, what do you think this is? I think this is not uh, something where we can just fry it and and marinate it in the same day. Yeah, exactly. I think you got the point. I think you That's got the point. That's what it sounded like. I actually did some steps before today, oh. which we're gonna run through really quick. I'm I'm gonna, we're gonna show you the ingredients, and I'm gonna explain to you, you know, what the. All right. First of all, let's talk about the cleaning process. All right. So I took the pork, which is in here. Okay. Gave her a nice cleansing bath in some vinegar, in some lime juice, okay? In this sour orange and some salt, okay? Cleaned her off, let her sit in that. You know what I'm saying? Let her, let her- Marinate. Sort of, but not really. Oh. Sit in that for, for a couple hours. I came Sweet. home and it was time to apply the marinade, okay? But first I had to make something to do the marinade, okay? So in Haiti, Haitian food culture. They have um, a Haitian seasoning blend. It's called a piece. A piece. A piece. Heard this before. Okay, so what I had to do to make the a piece was I had to blend some bell pepper. I had to bend some bend. <laughs> bend it like Beckham, baby. <laughs> I had to blend some bell pepper. You know, I had to blend some parsley, green onion, <laughs> sour orange in there, saffron, my good girl Maggie, oil. You feel me? Okay, y'all, so this is what the apice I made looks like. Mm -hmm. Oh, I put garlic in it as well. Wow, so we we can't have quiet on set? Yeah, God, that's our intern. <laughs> what have I told you? Your, your intern is God? Sorry, just have to deal with that. God is working for you, situation. Huh? I mean, he's really working for us all. Oh, I forgot to mention, I also put purple onion in the apice, okay. All right, now I'm gonna show y'all um, what it looks like after marinating. Can I get a drum roll, please? Can I get a drum roll, please? Any I'll day now, it. can I get a drum roll, please? Okay, oh, God, okay. Look at that, she's in the bowl. <laughs> the pork was marinated in a piece, okay? We put a little lorries in there, you Lowry. know what I'm saying? I put a little bit of extra. Lowry. Maggie in there, you know, Maggie. I put a little extra sour orange Not in there. So there she is. So now we're gonna boil her. So what we're doing is we're gonna put the pork into the pot so they can boil. 
It's gonna... Oh wow. Mmm. Mm. Yummy. Epis. Do you know how to say pork in Spanish? No. <laughs> <clears throat> Do you know how to say pork in Haitian Creole? Um, no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and then we turn the pun. Yeah, you. the fire. <laughs> little cinematic. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Is that safe? <laughs> Probably not. All right, let me stop. Um, Get a little closer. Uh-oh. There you go again. Talking cinematic. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe this is really happening. Oh my god, it's boiling. It's bubbling in like three places. <laughs> My son. Bubble double toilet trouble. Okay, my cauldron, she bubble. Oh! <laughs> Let me stop. All right. Uh, oh. And what, what do we have there? Oh, we have. Are you gonna say what it is? Oh, <laughs> I thought you were doing some time right here. Mm. T H Y. Can never have enough. Can never have enough time. We're just putting <laughs> that in the um, thing. Just like lay it on there. Yeah, you know. Like you a, know, like it's a baby. <laughs> and this is, one. Oh, this is parsley, right? Yes. All of it, right? Parsley. Um, so like just a big chunk. <laughs> you just gonna put that? I mean, baby girl, that's not enough. I mean. So we just gonna throw it in there. You know, it's it's gonna get the flavor. It's gonna get the flavor. Easy. Any either way. While that boils, we're gonna cut our uh, bell pepper. Y'all, we're teaching Joshua how to cut bell peppers today because he don't know. Yeah. Here I am educating the youth. No child left behind, as Mr. President, um, former President George Bush wow. once said in 2001. Yeah. To the left. Take it back now, y'all. Oh. Two cuts this time. <laughs> <laughs> Cha-cha, real smooth. Turn around. Oh. oh. <laughs> I thought he said turn it up. <laughs> that probably is what he said. All right. Joshua's turn. Joshua is up to bat. Joshua is at the mic. Okay. But you don't want to cut all the way. No. <laughs> oh. What the <laughs> no seeds in this house. Am I right? Or am I right? You're right. <laughs> <laughs> two, two, two. <laughs> Wow. Um, I think it's okay. I think it's okay. I don't think that's gonna kill anybody, so it's fine. Okay. Wow, this knife needs to be sharp. <laughs> okay, per bell peppers cut, bell peppers done, bell peppers extinguished, what? bell peppers <laughs> slayed, oh. one could say. <laughs> Let the record show I washed this onion, okay? Cause I'm, I'm gonna get a comment. I'm gonna be like, girl, come on. <laughs> Do you even wash your onions? Do you even wash your armpits oh. when you shower? Sorry, whoever left that comment. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. All right, this is how she's looking currently. We threw some extra parsley in there. Um. So. We're, I'm trying to see like, how do I know when this is done? You know what I'm saying? Like, so I'm trying to cut the, I'm trying to cut the pork with my fork. See if it's like, you know, soft, whatever. It kind of isn't, so I guess it's not done. Yeah, it looks a little chewy still. Don't get really uh, chewy. Uh, yeah, she's not. It does look good get, though, and it smells so good, get, guys. Get back in there, babe. Get back in the water! And you can't come out, okay? I know you're eager. <laughs> Wah! Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it looks good. Two hours later. <laughs> That's what it's giving. That's what it's giving. So we're gonna taste it to make sure it's cooked. We'll do this one. I just know it's done. I just know it. <laughs> it looks <laughs> in. Brilliant. Beautiful. Oh my god. Um, so I found this and I thought it was me. 
so I tasted it. I think it's paper. <laughs> For the culture. <laughs> <laughs> For the culture, look what we added to the. I tried to cut it too, like an idiot. That's so crazy. Wah wah wah. <laughs> <laughs> mm, did it taste good though? <laughs> they got fibers in paper, you know. Oh, don't sleep on it. <laughs> don't sleep on it. Y'all are out here doing keto. Meanwhile, have you tried the paper diet? What I'm gonna do now is uh, cook that and that. They said you do have to strain the the meat from the liquid, like the excess, but I'm like, that's a waste. Like, why well, I gotta strain it? True. I don't feel like it. So. <laughs> and while this is cooking, oh. So here's the problem. This is the only pot we got that we could fry in. So I actually should have probably put transferred this whole thing into another thing. <laughs> but I didn't do that. So we're gonna cook this and then we're gonna fry the meat which we separated into this bowl here it is the current state of our veggies we transferred it from the other pot to this skitty bang skitty bop bop skitty biddle bop doodle <laughs> <laughs> so yeah that was just cooking in the meat juice gravy Ew. <laughs> why Sorry. would you say that yeah we added some water to it because you know she was looking a little dry mm, yes. she was looking a little parched <laughs> So uh, she's hydrated now. Um, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna add our vegetable oil here and start frying our pork. <laughs> the ASMR. <laughs> we turn it on, let's move this pot. You don't need to get caught in the crossfire. The time has come. Y'all can see me right now. I look like I'm about to battle like the Spartans. Like I'm holding the shield like I'm Captain America. Okay, and this is my my sword. All right, y'all. I'm about to. Is it done? Damn it. Okay. She's <laughs> crack a She crack a lacking. Okay, I know my. Look, it's a little worn out. I feel like it's done. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. You feel like it's done, right? Um, I don't know. Like, I really don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know either. All right, I think it's done. Joshua, the stove was off. <laughs> Even though it was on high. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Ooh. Ooh. I keep it in. <laughs> Friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your plates so I can put pork grill on it. Nope. Oh, 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 oh. That I'm was tired. a lot. <laughs> I love pork real. What did we call it? Pork real. Because <laughs> oh, I keep that? hearing pork real. <laughs> it's grio. Grio. Pork grio. Ja, ja, ja. <laughs> Jai ho. You are the reason that I breathe. Jai ho. You are the reason that I still believe. You remember that song? <laughs> no. From Slumdog Millionaire? <laughs> na, na, na. Oscar I've winning not film. I've seen that movie. Na, na, na. It was before your time. Um, Pork Grio. <laughs> G R I O T. That's how you smell it. Smells amazing, tastes amazing. And now it's fried. And now it's fried. And now it's fried. Let's move on. Okay, guys, so this is the pork griot, the fried bits, yeah? 
had a piece, tasted a bit dry. Uh, so may have messed up there, but we'll see. Okay, then we plated, so I made some couscous. Not very Haitian of me, but you know, I'm not Haitian. Um, but <laughs> whatever, it was faster than rice. Okay, so I made couscous. Um, there's the pork grill, there's the gravy with the veggies. Mm -hmm. Joshua, let's see your plate. I've got it right here. Okay, let's show the girls. Oh, and there she goes. Isn't she lovely? <laughs> and now, we taste everything. <laughs> Personally, the gravy's the star. I know I just dropped some. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we fried the pork too long. <laughs> I also like want a fourth thing on this plate. Like, I don't know what the fourth thing would be. So traditionally, this is served with pickles on the side. Pickles is like fermented cabbage and um, carrots and like mm. bell peppers. And I have the ingredients to make it, but what had happened yesterday was, right? It was Thanksgiving yesterday. So what had happened was, I had to like clean the meat and then I made the et piece. And then after that, I was so tired and it was time to get ready to go to Thanksgiving dinner. So it was like, I couldn't really make the pickles. So that's why I don't, it's not on the plate. Why you had to call me out in front of the people? You know, in my day, we handle as a family, we handle things internally. We didn't let externally people know about it. We would just handle it within us. And you just went and tell my business. Okay, whatever. That's toxic. It's fine. Yeah, it is toxic. No, Brittany. Thank you for joining me on today's episode of For the Culture Kitchen. I, I'm speechless by this betrayal, mm -hmm. by this backstabbing. Um, the Brio is leaving me speechless. The Brio is leaving me speechless. The Brio. Excuse Not me. Not the Brio. I don't know who Brio is. You know. It's an Italian restaurant. That's fine for me to go. Yeah, that's okay. Well, thanks for, for watching. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Um, see you again next time and peace. <laughs>